Mr. Tanuki Suit here, and welcome to Let's Play Super Mario Kart. Hell yes. That's right, Super Mario Kart. Um, as usual, I have to preface this by saying, I'm using a keyboard, so it's okay to suck. Right, folks? Uh, yeah, so this LP will be completely uncut. Uh, <laughs> For better or worse, uh, no fancy editing to get rid of mistakes, nothing. And uh, to be honest, I never played Super Mario Kart. Um, I played Mario Kart 64, I played Mario Kart Double Dash on GameCube, and I played uh, Mario Kart DS, which uh, I would have to say is probably my favorite. Um, but yeah. Um, so this might be a little rough getting off, but, uh, you know, I have some fun here. Link, uh, Link's Awakening is getting a little old. I'm not going to stop, but, you know, I need to spice it up a bit here. So, yeah. Um, this is the 50cc class, uh, Mushroom Cup. So it's the most basic of basics. And, uh... I chose uh, Koopa because he's medium. Um, it's uh, he's very he's not as balanced as Mario, I don't think, but you know he's balanced enough, and I like the way he controls. And I guess uh, there's kind of a tension between players as to who's the best racer, and I guess it's between Koopa and Yoshi, and uh, I tried Yoshi and I wasn't digging it, and uh, there is no way I'm going to try and prove anything by playing a bad racer, so, uh, yeah, I'm going with Koopa for this one. And Luigi takes first. Best. Yeah, third is not cool. That's not cool at all. But it's okay. It's alright. It's not all about winning, right? Wrong. It's all about winning. Why would you want to lose? Losers don't get anything. Anyway, if you play a certain character, uh, you will always have like a specific rival. So, I believe Mario's is, take a wild guess, Bowser. And if you're Luigi, um, the... Uh, brother, who's... I was just trying to think of some way to describe his unfortunate position in the Mario series. I mean, that guy gets no love. Luigi's always, always getting put down. And he's the taller brother, like, you think Peach would be all over him, but uh, that's just not the case, unfortunately. She likes him short. <laughs> so yeah, um, anyway. So, of course, Luigi doesn't get, like, a really cool rival. He gets, like, the standard foot soldier. He gets a standard run-of-the-mill Koopa, you know. Just can't win. Just can't win, can you, Luigi? Actually, in my book, Luigi does win because I enjoyed the living hell out of Luigi's Mansion. You know, people always make fun of that game, but... I love Luigi's Mansion. In fact, GameCube? I don't know. It's it's really hard to say. Like In the generation of the PS2, Xbox, and GameCube, it's a very, very, very close tie between PlayStation 2 and GameCube. Xbox is a pile of crap and always will be as far as I'm concerned. The only thing they've got going for them is Halo, and I don't know how going that is. Um, yeah, because, I mean, seriously, the GameCube had Mario Sunshine, Luigi's Mansion, Smash Brothers, Animal Crossing, uh, Wind Waker, Twilight Princess, although I wasn't a huge Twilight Princess fan. In fact, I think uh, Wind Waker is vastly superior. A lot of people complain about the art style, but... Uh, I wasn't one of the folks that jumped on the bandwagon after they found out it was awesome. I was I was on board 
from the beginning. I love the art style. It's a mix of Japanese and like Tim Burton. It's really unique in the cell shaded cartoon look. It's just it's a beautiful looking game. In fact, it still holds up to this day just due to the art style. It's so well designed that I think that game's gonna age really well. Yeah. As you can tell, this is more of a just kind of me talking. There's not much to say unless you want me to commentate on the suckage of my playing ability. But who wants to focus on the negative, right? Yeah, so this is just going to be me rambling and rambling, and uh, I don't want to be an exhibitionist about it, but uh, if something really lame happens, you might want to plug your ears. I'm not going to make a point of it. This isn't the intention to have uh, foul language humor, but um, sometimes I just can't help myself like that. You know, I'm not, I'm not gonna, not yet. You know, let's eat that sucker. Yeah, of all guys, I got Louis or uh, Yoshi. Who's the best man now? Yeah, I actually remember my roommate. Really quiet, uh, very straightforward, no nonsense, very polite. You know, very, very reserved, very conservative, and he got. Uh, we had a Wii in the living room, and we had, well, Mario Kart Wii, and we had those stupid little plastic wheel peripherals that, you know, you plug the Wii mode into. Third again! Man, <laughs> it's not working out. Anyway, he's in his pajamas. He actually had Wii pajama bottoms, man. That guy loved the Wii. Anyway, and I was talking to my other roommate, and I hear in the living room, the F word just I mean it echoed like it was like Zeus was like cursing us from the heavens just it was so loud it scared us and it was just I don't know it was just this sudden outburst of anger because I guess Peach like got a blue shell on him thank god there are no blue shells in this game there's nothing worse then kicking some fat ass and then getting taken out with a blue shell. That has got to be one of the most frustrating things, especially in this game where it's like it takes a while for your engine to rev and like you're sitting there waiting and all these little cocksuckers are passing you up like winking at you and making little sounds. It's like I'm not, I don't like that. I don't like being patronized by Nintendo characters. Although, you know, Nintendo's a one-of-a-kind uh, I guess, publisher or whatever developer you want to call them. Like, in Super Smash Brothers, you know, like, it's a fighting game where Nintendo was smart enough to realize, hey, why don't we just take all our best franchises, stick the characters in arenas, and let players beat the crap out of each other? Like, I mean, you made a series out of your series characters fighting each other, like, that's brilliant. Anyway, uh, it could have been really lame, but it's really good. Um, anyway, when you win and you get to, like, the results screen, all the characters applaud each other, like, the guy that was in fourth or third or second, they all applaud, you know, like, they all clap, it's like, that's just Nintendo, you know, that's really cool. It's a small touch, it can easily be overlooked, but it's very neat, you know. There's no fatalities or anything, you know. Mario's not gonna rip Bowser's spine out and step on his face. He's just going to clap, which is cool. Anyway, I'm in first here, and I just passed up Donkey Kong, one of my least favorite Nintendo characters. The games looked amazing on the Super Nintendo, but... I've never been a huge fan of monkeys, and, well, Donkey Kong is not going to make the difference. Alright, so, that looks like the end of our first video, and, uh, yeah, let's see the results here. I think the next video will be the finale. Yeah, it's not looking too hot here, folks. 